Understanding the five elements of fraudulent traits. These elements can eventually combine to negatively influence an individual's behavior. Integrity, or should I say the lack thereof? Integrity certainly does imply honesty, but it is not synonymous with honesty. Jojo visits a webpage that contains instructions on how to cheat your taxis. While she does not lie about her behavior to her friends and family, Jojo clearly demonstrates a lack of integrity, a quality of moral uprightness. Opportunity. The set of circumstances that make a behavior possible to execute. Jojo works for an investment bank and has received inside trading information about a stock that is expected to soar within the next week. Jojo tells nobody about her tip and decides to buy 500 shares of that stock to add to her private portfolio. Jojo had opportunity. Incentive. The one thing that motivates you to execute the behavior. Money, money, money. Jojo makes tens of thousands of dollars from her insider trading and decides to keep doing it. All of a sudden, opportunity accompanies money as an incentive. Attitude. The settled way of thinking or feeling about something. Jojo has become so caught up in her lifestyle that she no longer feels much remorse about her actions. Her conscience is not at all guilty. In fact, she craves more and more action. Capability. The ability or skill to carry out an action. It's not so easy for Jojo to pull this all off. While she lacks integrity, has opportunity, incentive, and an obdurate attitude, give credit where credit is due. She was capable of pulling this all off. The only problem? This is all temporary. It will catch up to her, and she will be caught. The five elements coexist and work together to promote feelings of overconfidence and superiority. Jojo is going down a very dangerous road. As her confidence builds, her greed and potential for failure will grow.